far as Canadian athletes go, you were the guy. I was the guy. I'm, I'm almost still the guy, which is a little bit sad 12 years later. Why do you think that is? Is it possible that the rest are all straight? <laughs> no. <laughs> um, you know, I wish there was an easy answer. I, I, for 12 years, have talked about this and tried to figure out why. There's so many different elements involved. I think uh, sport by nature is very conservative, right? It's, it's rule-bound. It's slow to change. Um, I think there's certain cultures that um, are more boys club male oriented and and there's a whole I guess argument well it's my personal life that was for me a long time it doesn't impact how I play but I'll tell you something George you know my last year swimming I had to make seven years improvement in about 10 months the world record was shattered in my event and there's a moment when I knew that this demon that I had inside was really holding me back from that external goal and I told one of my coaches, it was a woman, and the relief that I felt and the, you know, the improvement that I made actually made that seven years in less than I 10 months. That. So I really think there's a direct impact between being authentic, of course, and being able to get the most out of yourself. But people still are uncomfortable going there. And, and even women in, 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 you know, lesbians in sport, it's a different reason. They're encouraged not to come out, not to perpetuate the stereotype that all female athletes are lesbians. In the male side, it's, well, there are no gay athletes. So right. there's these two kind of same sides of a double-edged blade that keeps sport really, I think, behind the rest of society.